Hello, this small demo is about how using Merge Excel Sheets tool. So the purpose of this demo is to show how to merge sheets in one workbook with one sheet or mini sheets. The tool supports XLS, XLSX, XLSM and all CSV-like formats. It shows you how to merge sheets in one access table or mini tables and how to create one dynamic sheet with connected tables to data sources. And all this is done in three or more clicks. And all operations are done automatically without intervention of the user. Let's start by a basic demo. Let's say four Excel files with only one common sheet. Here we have four Excel data sources, Excel Workbook 1, Workbook 2, 3 and 4 with seven fields and with one common sheet, Sheet 1. So first thing we have to do is to select all four Excel files and do drag and drop on the tool and the files are added automatically. You can do this also by the buttons available on the right hand side of the tool. You have to select then the common sheet or the common sheets to be merged and click on the button merge and the operation is done automatically without the intervention of the user. And we have here the results shown in Excel file and the access database. Let's see now how to merge the same files but to separate sheets. That means each data source file will be important to a separate sheet or a separate access database. So we have sheet 1, sheet 2 and sheet 4 enumerated and the same thing for access database with enumerated tables. Let's see now how to merge hundreds and even thousands of Excel files in few minutes. Of course, the merge depends on your system, on the CPU and on the read-only memory. So in order to merge mini files you can add from a folder or you can do a drag and drop operation as we have seen before. So here we have 704 files. We can select all of them or we can select some. Once you have selected the source data files, you select the sheets you want to be imported. You can then select how you would like to import these data to Excel or to Microsoft Access database. As you see the operation is very quick and very speed. So you save many days of work by using this tool. One thing important is the fact that all data sources should have common sheets. And if you want to import data to Microsoft Access Database, 
they have also to have common fields. Let's see now how we can import data by creating dynamic tables connected to data sources. Note that this functionality, this feature is available only for Microsoft Excel 2007 and more. And let's finish this small demo with CSV files. That means all .csv files, .txt, .log, or .sc. So you select, we have we select only one data source. You can select as many data sources as you want. And in order to have a preview, you have just to select the main properties of the data sources and you click on the preview data to have a preview before importing data. Once it's done, you click on the OK button and the import is done as you see and you have the results shown on the Excel workbook with all data important including fields at the first line of the workbook. I thank you for your attention and have a good Excel merge.